Ready. Here with Nelly Corda, grounded out 468 today. I know a couple a couple blips on the card there, but pretty solid day overall. Just evaluate your round. Yeah, um, it was w windy early on. It was kind of sporadically windy, um, but then I guess once I got over a couple of my shots of winds died. So that those were my like two really big mistakes. Obviously, I three putted one because. Um, it's kind of grainy this year, and I didn't hit it too solid off the fairway. But other than that, I, I gave myself some good looks at birdie, um, some that I didn't convert as well. So I think those are positives going into um, the next three days. How do you kind of temper your expectations when those kinds of things happen, when the wind dies and you're over a shot and you, you clubbed up because the wind's going to blow? Yeah, um, obviously you're a little upset. You just try to make the most of your situation. I actually saved, like, to a 20 footer for a bogey on number two so I was like yeah <laughs> <laughs> so in a sense like that was a positive I, I did strike it well it's just it happens out here I mean you have the trees around where you're feeling the gust on the fairway and then when you hit it it's kind of protected around the green and it doesn't really hit it or you hit it too low because you're trying to kind of force it under the wind so that's just kind of the thing about being aggressive in this wind is that Sometimes you um, kind of get screwed. <laughs> um, <laughs> and finally, I mean, it, it, it makes sense that you play well so well here, being a Florida girl and being familiar with these yeah. conditions. But what is it about Tiburon in particular? There's not a lot of teeth in this golf course, but I know the greens get pretty tricky. Correct, yeah. Um, fairways, the thing is, like, with my distance, like, let's say 17, like, that water comes into play. Or, like, a lot of par fives, I actually, because of my length, I have to thread it. Mm -hmm. as well so it's like yes there's an advantage to being long but you first got to hit the shot to have that advantage so I would say like if you're striking it well on this golf course you will have a couple looks here and there um, that are a little bit shorter than maybe the other girls if you're longer but um, you still got to hit the shots so um, yeah I like playing on Bermuda playing on the Bermuda grass obviously on the green um, I grew up on it so I'm used to it awesome okay um, when you make a bogey putt like that, does it almost feel like a birdie? Like yeah. <laughs> you're like, thank God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what would you say, um, you know, you hit 14 fairways today. Do you tinker that much with your driver? Have you been using the same driver for a long time? No, I actually switched drivers the week of, so I had the TSI one Titleist the week of pretty much all last year and two, um, God, what Arkansas, and that's where our TaylorMade guys JJ came out from uh, from Titleist. Oh my God, Titleist <laughs> came out. Can we scratch that? <laughs> um, the that Titleist, yeah. JJ from Titleist came out and um, fitted me uh, for the TSR one that was just launching that week, and I gained a good bit of distance because um, I was hitting that TSI one really good but my um, spin was too high. But since I was hitting fairways, I didn't really mind because it took me so long to find a driver and they did so well by fitting me in a, in a really good driver that when I tried the TSR, like I just immediately loved it and I actually picked up some roll and I got the spin down and yeah, I'm, I'm hitting it a little further. What, what is a little further? Um, probably like, I would say five yards, five, five, 10 yards, which makes a difference, I mean. If yeah. you get a hole that's downwind, you, your spin's less, I mean, and it shoots on you. I mean, that's a club or almost two sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just my last question. You talked about being mentally fatigued at times mm -hmm. in the year. How do you feel now from the neck up? I was, <laughs> yeah, I was, I was tired yesterday during the prone. Thank God we were in uh, carts. <laughs> I really enjoyed <laughs> the uh, being in carts during the pro-am and then I just honestly I just take it easy I know that this is a kind of a long week um, so I've just kind of been taking it easy not trying to overdo it but you feel fresh in a way and yeah, I mentally good. I mean yeah. yeah I feel good maybe a win helps that yeah I guess <laughs> I've always said like it's super hard to win back to back um, and hats off to the people that do because it is really hard but um, yeah I, I feel I feel okay but you've done that before. I have, yeah. I thought it was, like, impossible because I always played so bad the week after, so hopefully I don't this week. But, yeah, we'll see. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Good start. <laughs> Thank you.
Thank you.